Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geekabit. I am Penge and welcome back to Abandoned Ship. So we have done one very small video for Abandoned Ship in the combat demo just to show you the basics of it. We did a couple of the combat demo battles to show you how the combat works on a very basic level. We didn't go to the ports, we didn't buy any of the stuff, we didn't buy any extra crew. We just showed you how the ships fire at each other, how you go nearer and further away, how you repair the damage, all that kind of stuff. In this video... We are going to try and do as much as we can of the combat demo. So let's click the button here. So this combat demo will take you through 10. <laughs> We're not going to make it to 10. 10 sequential battles of increasing difficulty. I'm not going to make it to level 10 on this. Um, and in the full game, you can navigate through the world via exploration mode. As mentioned previously on the other video, uh, there is an exploration mode in the full game. There is also a video available, I shall link to it in the description of this video uh, on the website which shows you more about the exploration mode if you're interested. Okay so here we go. So 10 sequential battles of increasing difficulty. Okay this could be a bit silly. Okay before you commence your first battle would you like to visit port or review your crew? After this point you will have a limited amount of times you may visit port. So I think it's probably a good idea. Let's manage our crew first so to, see, to see who we've got, as I forget how to talk. So we've got a captain, a gunner, a sailor, and a navigation person. A navigator. That would, that would be what they're called. A navigator. So we've got those four. Okay, right. What we're going to do is, first things first, because you can, we're going to change their names. There, I think that's a bit better. Penge the captain. Betty on the guns, so the explosives, because, you know, Betty loves things that go boom. Bernard, he repairs things, and Catface, our navigations person. Okie doke. Right, so let's close that. Let's go to port, because this doesn't count as one of the times we can go to port. And I think to start with, I think buying a new crew member might be a good idea. We've got 175 gold as it stands right now. And now this is intriguing. Harper, the surgeon does a lot of very cool things but look they're good at other things they're good at surgery they're also doing a good at a, a little bit of swashbuckling harper is not averse to a bit of swashbuckling and harper has three tiers of uh, of manning weapons there that's pretty good however Wright is a sailor he has four bars of repairing stuff so that could be quite good i mean can we can we get rid of asta drag your crew here to dismiss them i mean do we get rid of bernard Replace him with Wright. Because Wright seems a lot better. We'll get rid of Bernard. We'll replace him with Wright and we'll just rename him. So let's dismiss Bernard because Bernard's a bit rubbish. Let's get Wright on board. Beautiful. So it leaves us with 115. I think then we get Harper as well. I think Harper's very, very good. And a surgeon, but also many other skills as well. Yeah, you're good. We'll get you. We'll get a surgeon on board. That helps an awful lot. Yeah, look, you've got loads of it. You've got extra skills compared to everyone else. You're very cool. We like you. Uh, okay, right. So we can't buy anything else. We've got 15 gold now. We can't buy anything else, unfortunately. But what we can do is we can visit the... Uh, oh, no. Uh, go back out to sea. We want to manage our crew because we want to change their names. Okay, so he has been renamed Bernard because he can repair things. And this one here, I wasn't sure if the surgeon was a, was a lady, but I, I think it must be a man. They don't let ladies on ships in this era, do they? It was bad luck to have ladies on board. So I assume this surgeon is a is a gentleman. He's a, he's a man. And I have called him Mr. G. My good pal, Mr. G, member of the YouTube Wolfpack. Go and check everyone out in the YouTube Wolfpack. They're all very, very, very good. And uh, yes, it was on his channel that I first saw a video for this game and thought, yeah, i got to have me a bit of that. So let's drag him in. So he is a surgeon. But look, he's also multi-skilled as well, which is just like him in real life. So there we go. Now let's go to battle. Now this first battle should be okay. Now why isn't my navigation person actually at the wheel? That's a little bit irritating. Unless they're really terrible. Catface has got two navigation. Um, hang on. Click. Click you. You're not Catface. You're the captain. That's me. Catface. Betty. Oh no. Right. Okay. Yeah. So I have got two. Yeah. So Catface is the same. But I'm more talented in other places as well. Right. Me, I'm going to go over to that. Navigator can come up here. You can man that. Mr. G can man that. And Bernard can wait in the middle for us to take some damage. In fact, no, Bernard, go up there, actually. Go up here. You might as well man that while we're there. Right, and let's try and get nearer to them. They're trying to get away. 
we want to get a little bit nearer because they're trying to maintain a distance we want to get nearer to them in fact let's try and get really close let's try and get really close okay so let's fire at them oh they're going for our sails they're going for our sails they're getting even further away look they're getting even further away right repair the sails repair the sails because they're going to not going to let us get anywhere near right fire at them and that thing can go any range so we can fire at their sails. Hopefully that'll damage their sails a bit. Yes, look, it's allowing us to catch up. So we need to just keep firing at them with this. Knock their sails. Knock great big holes in their sails. That might help. And as you can see, because we're so far away, we can't see the status of anything at the minute on their ship. We don't really know what's going on because it's so far away. Right, fire again. Hook shot stuff on it. There we go. Lovely. Yep, we can get a bit nearer. We're going to edge a bit nearer to them. That's good. Uh, right, yes, go, go and repair. Go and heal up, in fact, because you're a bit injured. And then go and repair this. Yes. Good job. Good job, whoever you are. Good job, Bernard. Okay, right. They're, they're hitting us with things. They're hitting us with things. They're hitting the medic bay. Right, and again. Do that on their sails. Smack. Right. It's hurting their sails. Oh, gosh. Yeah, look at that. We're getting really close. We're getting very, very close. Another good shot on that with their sails. On their sails should... Should be enough to get to ramming speed. If we can do that. Yeah, let's fire it again. Bash. Beautiful. Right, ramming speed. Do the thing. Brace. Brace for impact, everybody. We're going to smack into them. And that's taken them down. Beautiful. Yes. Yep, there you go. Goodbye, fellas. Goodbye, enemy. There you go. Your ship's blowing up around you. Oh, someone went to the wheel, though. At least you're going down with the ship. That's very noble. At least there was a little bit of nobility at the end there. Well done. 64 gold. Continue. Okay, now we can only go back to port five times. We've got nine battles left. We're not going to do another nine. But uh, no, let's go to the next battle straight away. We're not going to use up that, uh, that go, if you like. Right, you can go there. Navigator can go on there. Mr. G can go on there. Betty can go on there. And you can go... I think you should lurk in the middle and just repair things. I think that's your job, Bernard. Just lurk around and wait for them to do something and then repair. Just commence... Re in fact, no, they're getting near. Go and do this thing. Go and do the killy gun that kills the people. That's a good plan. Right, okay. Okay, and bash. Right, you fire. Splendid. Now Betty can fire. And then you can have a go at their sails. Okay, so there we go. A massive barrage of things all at once. Three things firing at them pretty much straight away. Okay, they've battered our hull a little bit but i think we'll be okay yeah i think we'll be fine i think we're okay okay use that on those guys yep there we go splat right okay that's damaged them that's good we've caused a hole in their hull let's damage their sails this is going terrifyingly well we're gonna be able to ram them as well soon in a moment once this thing tops up come on get to ramming speed get to ramming speed oh look there you go what was that save the position your crew are on the ship right commence ramming speed brace Everyone's braced. Let's ram them. That causes a massive load of damage. Ramming them is a brilliant thing to do. Right, whack that. Whack that as well. Lovely. Oh, one more hit and we would have had some of them. Right, back away a minute, I would say. <laughs> a little bit near. A little bit near. Oh, one of their guys is in the sea. Has one of their guys just died? Oh, I think we just drowned one of their guys. <laughs> Sorry. But you are baddies, I suppose. So that's fine, isn't it? Their ship's not going to last much longer, is it? They are not going to last much longer at all. Oh, no, we've got a great big hole in the hull, everybody. Right, go and repair that. You can just go and repair that now. That's absolutely fine. Right, you fire that at him. Bash. And then go and do the pump thing. You go and do the pump thing. Da, 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 right, and you can fire at their sails. Like that. Bash. Uh, you just like that out. Right, okay. You go back and man the guns. Go back and man the guns. Right, you're pumping the water out. This is good. One decent volley from this. I think this will probably be it. Bash, bash, bash. Yep, they are gone. They are sunk. Farewell, enemy vessel number two. We are doing well. And you know what? Let's just fight your sails for the sake of it. Ha <laughs> ha. Have that. There we go. Down it goes. And we get some gold from it. Another 64. Okay, not as much as I would have liked, but never mind. Right, okay. For two battles are eight to go. I think our hull is okay. Let's go to the next battle. Because we don't want to uh, use up all our trips to port. And I suspect as it gets later on, things are going to be harder. So I think we're okay for now. I think we go to the next battle now. We've got a good team. We've got a good team of people. It's very good. Right, okay. Damage the sails. You go over to navigate. 
You man those. You man those. You go up there onto that thing. Okay. Once somebody is on the wheel, like so, let's try and get a bit nearer. Okay. They're also doing it. They're getting nearer as well. Yeah, our hull's okay. We've taken, what, we're 20% down? That should be okay. All right. Come on. 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 We want to get first, first shot in. Okay. You. First shot. Then that on their sails. Lovely. Then that on their hull. Right. So already they're sort of equal to us in terms of their strength already. Right. Okay. Whack them with that. Whoa. Okay. Okay. That caused significant damage. Right. The guy, he's repairing it. They're all repairing things. It's all good. It's all good. Okay. Right. One of these weird monster things is coming in. Now imagine this might be explained by the story. As it stands right now, they're not, it's not really explained. Right, go on. Kill, kill the scary monster. Kill the scary spike monster. Okay, you man that for a second. Fire at their shields. You fire at those two. Okay, now the captain needs to go and heal up. So let's go and get the captain over there to heal. Because he's injured. So me. So Captain Penge, of course. Go and heal yourself at the surgeon's table. Which is good. Now I imagine we heal quicker because there's a surgeon on board, possibly. Okay, now you can come over here. You can help repair this. Need to repair the uh, repair the helm while we're still doing this. You can damage all those three, and again, it's good to damage them because it means they run off. They leave their station. They go and heal, which takes them out of action from you know maybe firing guns or piloting the ship. So they uh, get this this bonus. Right, we're now going to do this. Brace, brace for impact. Slam into them. Bash. Try and back out as soon as we can. Come back out that way. Oh, beautiful. That was beautiful. Right, fire them at the back. Lovely, that's injured them. They've got hull breaches and stuff all over the place on their ship. They are absolutely in trouble. Right, okay. Couple more rounds of cannon fire, and I think they will be done. I think that's it, is it? Ah, oh, just, they're just surviving. They are just hanging on. Okay, let's fire at their sails, and let's fire at the crew. Bosh, there we go. Right, come on, last volley, and back, sorted. We didn't take much damage there at all. And the stuff we took, we've repaired from here. So yeah, that's going pretty well. That's good. Yeah, we need to go back to port, I think, now and spend some of the money we have earned. Come on, give me more than 60, whatever it is on this one. Come on, 100 and something. Ugh. The vessel sinks entirely, but leaves behind a few floating valuables. And so the sea is offering you up its thanks for littering it with a load of wooden corpses. Oh, good. Okay, continue. Let's go to port. We've fought three battles, seven to go, five trips to port. So let's have a look. Now, I don't think we need any more crew at the minute. Our crew are fine. We want to repair and upgrade the ship. So first thing we want to do, in fact, down here, repair all for 21 gold. I think that's what we want to do. We repaired the hull. It's now all lovely and back as it should be. So here we can buy stuff for the ship. So heavy hull spikes, large metal spikes that uh, add to the side, causing high damage when ramming, which is good. Now, I do like the idea of those. I do like the idea of those. The crow's nest is for use when it's like foggy and stuff like that. So you get greater visibility on the crew, on the enemy ship. Oh, automatic water pump's fairly obvious, but I think we're okay with that for now. Or we could get ourselves some weapons. What I think we might do, because I quite like ramming the other ships, I think we do this. I think we go for heavy hull spikes, drop them on. Look at that. That looks very cool. And then can we get one of the 75, 90, or 60? So level 2 sick bay. That makes the ship go quicker. That recharge your manoeuvre bar at a greatly improved rate. That could be useful. Or do we get ourselves an acid bomb? Or do we save our money? Or we could... Actually, let's do this. Let's spend 60 of our money on buying another couple of cannons for that side. There we go. So they can hold five cannons on each side. So now I've just upgraded each side to have an extra cannon. Okay, I like that. Return to port. Back to sea. Next battle. So the hull is all repaired. Right, so roiling dark clouds burst with rain, which lashes down, soaking everything. Fires will be extinguished by rain. Okay, well, that's a good thing. That helps. I like that. Right, you go up there. You go to just there. You man that. You man that. You stand in the middle. Right, okay, there we go. So we're all doing something. Let's try and get nearer to them. Now, ideally, 
We want to ram them with the big, terrifying spikes of doom. I do like the idea that there's just a load of angry metal spikes. You just drive into them. That's very cool. Right, okay. Both of these are ready. Right, fire at your sails. Fire at your hull. And then bang, 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 bang. And then fire at the hull. Okay. Smash, smash, smash. Right, splendid. That's done that. So that's the first barrage in. Right, they are attempted to fire out of right. Is there any fires? Nope, okay, but we have taken a little bit of damage up there. So let's go and repair that. More cannons firing. Beautiful. Damage their sails, like so. More firing going on at them. Right, he's repaired everything. Get back into the middle, because you never know where the next thing might be that needs repairing. Tiny bit of hull damage. Teeny tiny bit. Ooh, right, okay. Now there is a fire. Will the rain put that out? I don't know, but we're going to go and deal with it as well. There we go. Splendid. Okay, right. Prepare for ramming speed. Let's ram them. Let's see how much damage it causes. It's... Oh my goodness. It's an awful lot of very lovely damage. <laughs> These massive spikes are brilliant. Okay, right. Massive spikes are the way to go. Massive spikes are the way to go. Okay, Mr. G, keep on firing. Keep on firing. You keep on firing. And that's it. We're done already. We are done already. Listen to that. It's just exploding and... Should we fire up their sails? No, they haven't got any sails anymore. The sails have fallen off. <laughs> the sails have gone. And it sinks. Down it goes. The ship is destroyed. We collect what we can. Continue on. 64 gold. Splendid. Continue. Okay, four battles. Six to go. We can go to port four more times. I think we go and do the next battle. And then go to port after that. Because we haven't really got much gold. We've only got 90 gold. It's not really worth it as it stands right now. So yeah, I think next battle... The ship wasn't that badly damaged, as I remember. No, it's hardly damaged at all. Thick fog embraces you, obscuring visibility. The level of crow's nest on your ship will determine what you can see of the enemy crew and their ship sections when your vision is impaired. Uh, if you do not have an advanced crow's nest, which we don't, and are fighting at the furthest range, some weapons that target crew individually, sniper and tackler, which we don't have, will not function. So I imagine you could use that tactically with you if you knew that the opposition had a sniper or whatever a tackler is you could say all right i'm not going to use i'm going to go away far away and uh, make sure they can't use the sniper and the tackler against me okay so let's continue right okay pause let's do the necessary bits and bobs to get everybody in the right places so yeah move you over to there you command those guns you command those guns you can sort of stand in the middle right okay now we need somebody over there to get nearer Right, so we're getting near. They've got an awful lot of crew. Three, four, five. They've got seven crew members. What's that? Oh, he's one of the scary monster things that can swim over and try and kill us. Okay, yeah, he's a kind of weird monster thing. Now, you can buy um, people that fight against them. You can have certain crew types that fight against them. I think they're called... I can't remember what they're called now. Uh, Marines, possibly? Something like that. But they specifically, they're good at fighting. They're good at, like, hand-to-hand -hand combat stuff. Right. Let's do that. Bit of damage on those guys. Right, okay. Our sails are very much obliterated already. Right, let's repair the hull thing first. So we repaired the crack in the hull. Right, now let's go through and repair the sails. Because that was quite a hefty hit just there. That was a big old hit, that was. Right, again, aim at their sails. Bash. Right, their sails are also down. Right, here comes one of these weird things. Right, okay, so we're ready. We're ready for the weird thing with you two. So you can fight the weird thing. Go on, kill the weird thing. Kill it. Kill the weird thing. Yes, we've killed the weird thing. Okay, good. The weird thing is dead. Splendid. Right, keep repairing things. Go up here and repair this. Uh, you've taken a bit of damage. Okay, right, this is good. Right, right, those. You can fire at those. Right, that's that. Some damage. Deal some damage to you. Right, hull breach, hull breach. The sails are down again. Right, you need to go and heal up, I think, because you're quite hurt. Okay, you've healed that. Right, repair the, repair the sails. The sails are very damaged. The sails are very, very, very damaged. Ugh. Right, okay, they're causing some serious damage now. So we've got a bit of a bang there. We've got some water on board as well. So I would say, let's go over here. Let's get you to now empty the water out. And we're going to do this. Bray. So we're going to cause them some serious damage by ramming the beautiful and firing at their things as well. Oh, that's destroyed them. That's taken them out. Oh, yes. Okay, there we go. Right, that's taken them out. We've not taken much damage to our hull at all. There we go, sorted. Now, the game, uh, the volume, I will turn the volume down 
But the game is making that weird kind of scratchy noise that sometimes Fallout used to make when I used to play Fallout. Very really weird kind of k -k 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 noise. Not entirely sure why it does that. Okay, I think we go to port and we buy ourselves a big weapon. We don't need another crew member just yet. I think we're going to buy ourselves something to stick on here, like a mortar, to stick on the front of the ship. So a section damager. Cannon that trades high section damage for no hull damage. So high damage to section, zero damage to hull, small damage to crew. So that will take out like individual bits. So we could take out their, I don't know, their guns or their med bay or whatever. That starts fires, however. I like the idea of a thing that starts fires. I think that's a good thing. Can we have that? Oh, we have to drop it up there, do we? Why can't we have that? I want that. I want a thing that starts fires, please. Okay. For some reason, I can't have the thing that starts fires. I'm not entirely sure why I can't have the thing that starts fires. Maybe that's not in the game yet or something? I don't know. Okay, well, let's repair all anyway. Let's repair the ship. How can I have it? Mm, no? Okay, fine. Well, I won't have that then. Uh, upgrades. And I am tempted by that as well. I am tempted by a third mass to make the ship go quicker. Hull plating could also be quite useful. There's so much cool stuff to have in this game. It's so good. Okay, an acid bomb. An acid-filled mortar shell that damages crew in the area, stopping them from entering until the effect has passed. Area effect lasts for a short duration. Crew in the area damaged, no hull or section damage. So it purely batters the, uh, batters the, the crew and that's it. Yeah, look, I can't have either of those. For some reason, I can't have that or that. I don't know why. Or a sniper. I can't have that either. Okay, that's a bit weird. But I can have the acid bomb. Let's put that in the middle. Why the heck not? Now, can I have that? No. Okay. And we've got a bit left. Let's get that. Helm level 2 recharges the maneuver bar at a greatly improved rate. Now, we like the maneuver bar because you can ram people. So let's upgrade that as well. Splendid. Six gold. Return to port, back out to sea, next battle, let's go. Lightning briefly illuminates the sky in jagged bursts. If lightning strikes the ship, a fire will break out. Okay, that's probably a bad thing. Right, let's get you into your positions. Oh, look, it's slightly different. It looks slightly different. Okay, you can go there, you can go there, and you can sort of stand in. Oh, no, you can man that, actually. Yes, we've got an acid bomb thing now, so you've actually got a job. Rather than just standing about, you can actually go and do something. That thing is going up very, very quickly. We'll be able to ram them before we can fire at them, pretty much. Okay, right. Pause. Right, that's going to have caused some fire damage, I think, on us. Which is unfortunate, but never mind. Oh, no, the sails. And, yeah, there's a fire. There's a fire. All right, you put the fire out. Priority, put out the fire. That's more important. Right, you bash their hull. Splendid. There we go. Fire's out. Back to this. Back to this. Man, back to this. Come on. Man the thing, man the thing. Oh, right, they're sniping at us. That's a bad thing. Right, Captain, go and heal. You, uh, yeah, acid bomb just there. E bang, right, that's hurting their crew. That's a good thing. We like it when their crew are hurt. Okay, run over to that way. Right, they're firing at us. I don't like it when they're firing nasty things at us. Stop it. Why is the fun in that? Right, okay, prepare for ramming speed. Right, ram them. So let's ram them while we can, smash into them, bang, massive damage, that is beautiful, that is tremendous, we want to top that up pretty much straight away, right, you, sir, right, pause it, you go and put that fire out, please, you fire at their sails, yeah, good, put out the fire, yeah, I think we're putting the fire out, okay, good, so the fire is done, right, now these guys are going to, yeah, I don't like him, they've got a sniper on board, they've got a sniper, He's knocked our captain down, but he didn't cause him any damage. So, haha, -ha, take that. Have that, you swine bags. Right, he is healed. We want to do that. Put him back onto the thing. Whoa, fire and stuff everywhere. Right, let's ram them again. Brace for impact. Brace. This should take them out, I think. Should take them out. It causes us damage as well, because they also have spikes. I think we have bigger spikes. Our spikes are better spikes. Right, we're very close. We're very close. Let's head back out a bit. Head out of the way. Right. Acid bomb them just there. Boom. Good noise. Good noise there. Right. And bang. And they're gone. They're done. They are down. They are out. They are gone. Yes. Explosions all round and sinking. Splendid. There we go. We have taken a little bit of damage. We've got a little bit of water on board. That's absolutely fine. People are injured. The evidence of your victory sinks, but your crew managed to salvage a fine-looking trunk filled with valuables. 
Okay, six battles, four to go, three to port. Do we go back to port now? We've only got 70 golds. We can't really buy anything. I think we risk it. I think we go to the next battle. Huge distant tidal waves roll inexorably towards you. When tidal waves occur, they trigger a brace test. Passing the test will knock all crew to the floor, but failing it will risk one of them being swept overboard. If there are any fires on deck, then a tidal wave will extinguish them. Oh, good. So it's inclement weather then at the moment. Right, you are. Okay. Right, let's get you on that. Let's get you on that. And let's get you on the mortar thing. We want to get nearer. Thank you very much. Not further away. So I've got to remember to press this. As soon as we hear a thing that says brace for impact, I've got to hit that button as much as I can. <laughs> Okie dokie. Okay. Can we fire at them? Right. Pause. So you fire. You take out their sails. And then you're going to be able to take out, their sail, uh, take out the hull even in a bit like that. Smash, smash, smash. Right. Okay. And then we want to get the... Ah, oh, so they've got the same as us. They've got the same as us. Okay. Where can we get two people? Just there, look. Right. You need to leg it out of there temporarily just quickly just run away run away go and heal go and heal up you can repair the the, the breaches that have oh my goodness erupted everywhere there's breaches everywhere oh my goodness me right damage their sails so we can catch up with them bash so that's injured their sails yep so we're getting slightly closer to them that's good you do that repair 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 are you in the acid i don't know if you're in the acid that's a really annoying place for the acid, though. If you could stop doing that with the acid, that'd be nice. Right, okay. You man the thing. We want to drop acid bombs right back on them. Okay, fire the hookshot thing. Right, they've hit our sails. Was that our sails they just hit? I don't know. Okay, they're acid bombing us again. Get out, go and heal. Crikey's, they're very good at this, aren't they? They're very accurate with their acid bombs. Brace, right, I've braced. Tidal wave. Okay, now hopefully did they brace as well? Yeah, it looks like they... Oh, no, one of their guys is overboard. One of their guys has gone over. Okay, that's good news. If I know you, go to that. You go to that. Let's fire that at there. So let's drop an acid bomb on their guns for a change. Bang! Right, have that, you swines. Right, that's going to do nothing. We need to get nearer. Come on, we need to get nearer, man. More sail damage. More sail damage. Right, we should be getting nearer now. Can we ram them? Yes, we can. Get nearer. Brace. Brace. Bracing. And... Smack. Oh, it's a heavy hit. We've taken quite a bit of damage because they've got big pointy sail uh, spikes as well. Not pointy sails. Don't know how good that would be. Right. Damage their sails. Damage the people standing just there. Oh, it's going to get another one as well. Bang. Beautiful. Right. They're being damaged. That's a good thing. Okay. Keep firing at them. Keep firing at them. This is good. This is good. We are hitting them quite hard right now. We're hitting them very, very hard. Brace. Right. Sails. Brace. Click the button. Braced. Oh, and he just... Did they brace? Did anyone go overboard? Looks like they braced as well. Right. Fire at them. Fire at them while they're down. Right. And there. In comes that. Right. You need to do that. You need to repair the thing. Right. Let's go and get rid of some water out of our hull while we're here. Thinking about it. Let's go and get rid of some water, because we've got loads of water in the hole. You need to empty some of that out, my good man. Okay, come on. A couple of more. A couple more. In fact, let's ram them. Let's ram them. We'll ram them. We'll take them out. We'll go to port. We'll heal up, because we take a bit of damage. And they are gone. Sank, in fact. Goodbye. Sink now. Cheerio. Are you still sinking there? You're still sinking. Well, just get on with it. If you could sink a bit quicker, that'd be lovely. Thank you very much. And sorted, 128. A keen eye crewman spots a large sack emerge from a vessel filled with pearls. Beautiful. Three battles, three trips to port. Let's go each time. We might as well. Okay, let's repair the ship. That's priority number one. Repair everything because it was really badly damaged. Right, can we get any of these things now? Can we get a mortar? Yes, we can. Round shot is a type of cannon. I assume we upgrade the cannons, do we? Sure shot cannon prioritizes accuracy over damage. Round shot. What are our current ones? What's that? What is that cannon? I don't know what that is. Moderate hull and section damage. Small damage to crew. Very small chance of hull cracks. High hull and high section damage. Yeah, let's get a mortar. Let's just get a normal mortar in play. That looks kind of fun. Uh, we can't upgrade the sails. We could upgrade the medical thingy. Uh, advanced crow's nest winch. Now, I think we save. I think we save. In fact, do you know what we've got? 87. Let's pop another couple of guns on that side. There we go. So we've got 10. 
10 on port side now. Yes, there we go. That looks good. Okay, right. Sail back out to sea. Next battle. Let's see how this goes. Black columns of smoke spew from nearby volcanic well, from nearby volcanic mountains, clearly active. Distant boom will herald an eruption from one of these volcanoes. Shortly after, a storm of rocks will fall across the battlefield. When the smaller rocks hit your ship, they will start a fire. Larger rocks will smash through the deck, causing a whole crack. Oh, good. So basically, we want to do this as quick as we can. We want to hurry the heck up with this. Okay. Captain, go and man the mortar. You man those guns. You man those guns. You go and do that. You go and man the poison thingamabobber. Like this. Right, when you're there, we want to do that. Okay. This is good. They haven't got spikes, I don't think, on their ship either. There's no spikes. So this could be good. I like this bit at the start. I do quite like this. It's sort of all tension building. No one's got anything ready yet. We're going to have first blood. Bang. Right, okay. Only just, though. Only just. Right? You keep firing at that. Splendid. Okay, we've already got a hull crack. This is bad. Right, you fire that just there. Like that. Now you go and repair that hull crack. Captain. Now click that. Let's fire that up. Mm, not there. Yeah, there. I think we do that to there. Right, this could be beautiful. This could be beautiful. So that's acid in them. And that smashed those guys. Right, lovely. Okay, let's get back here. Fill in the hole just here. Man overboard? One of ours? Really? Who? Oh, God, it's the it's the dude. It's the, it's the medic. It's Mr. G. Come on, Mr. G, get back in. Get back in, my good man. Right, you've got a hull, a hull breach to deal with just there, Captain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you done it? Have you done it? Ah, oh, it come volcanic rocks. Oh, and it's causing hull breaches. It's causing hull breaches. Oh, my goodness. We have got hull breaches everywhere. But so have they. So that's a good thing. Right, everyone. Go and man. Go and man everything. Go and repair everything. We are taking some heavy hits. Right, now. look at this. Right, you go over there. You keep doing that. Keep firing those. Oh, no. We've got these creepy guys coming in. Right, come on. Two of them as well. This is a bit harsh. Right, fight. Fight. You fight. Oh, no, he's down. <laughs> he's down. Two of them. Are you down as well? Pause. You go and kill the thing. Kill the scary monster. Bash. Bash. Now the screen's going all crazy again. Right, we need to get to him. We need to save him or else he will be dead. Oh, no. Now he's going to be covered in acid. You need to get out of the way because that's full of acid. Mend the thing. Right, pause. Take stock of what's happening. You go and do that. You go and man that. You go to those cannons. Uh, who's down? Oh, the navigator. Okay, fine. He's mending a crack. Right, there's a fire. Right, captain. Go and sort that crack out. That's good. Right, hit the mortar. A mortar. Let's use the mortar on that just there. That's a beautiful place for a mortar. Bang and down. Lovely. Right, you can put out some fires. It will be on fire an awful lot as well. This is not good. It's not going as well as I thought it was going to. It's not going as well. Right, put the fires out. Put the fires out. Come on. More fires putting out, please. You, man the guns. What are you doing, man? There we go. Bang, 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 bang. Right. We need somebody up there doing some navigating. Right, we're going to whack them. Brace for impact. We're taking all sorts of... <laughs> this is carnage. What is happening? There is what our, our hull is full of water. Our hull is actually full of water. You need to go and pump. You need to pump water like you've never pumped before. But you, they're down. All right, should we try and aim just there? You do that with those. You go and sort that crack out. Right, you fired that. You go and sort that crack out. He's sorting other cracks out, right? He's pumping water. He is pumping water frantically. Okay, more water pumping, more water pumping. Right, you, go and repair that thing. Go and repair the crack. He's been sniped. No, this could be a disaster. Sort the water out. Sort the water out. Uh, no, don't stand there. Go and fix that. Go and fix the thing. Go and fix the water. Go and fix the crowd. No, there's a fire. <laughs> there's a fire. Right, go and sort the fire out. You, go and do. Go up there and sort that crack out. He's still pumping water. He's doing a grand job. Right, you, go and use the other pump. Go and use the other pump. We need to sort the... Our ship is full of water at the minute. Oh, no, man overboard. <laughs> What's going on? Right, get to the winch. It's hit. Right, save that person. Right, fill in the cracks. Fill in the cracks. Do that. Fill in the hull breaches. Right, then you need to go and put the fires out because there's an awful lot of fires going on. Right, fill in the fires. Fires. You. Fires. Go and sort the fires out. Oh, my God. Oh, not again, for goodness sake. Okay, this is impossible. 
This, it's all going wrong. That ship is not, they've not got anything to do. They're just firing at me. They are relentlessly, mercilessly firing at me. Uh, no, the mass are not up, so it's not even making any difference. Right, get the rest of the water out. Uh, oh, another man overboard. How, can we, how are we supposed to stop going man overboards? Right, okay, you. Oh, goodness me, there's more hull breaches. There's more fires. Why aren't they on fire? Why aren't they on fire? Are they not being got by the volcano thingies? Right, run down here. Sort the fires out. Sort the fires out. Oh my goodness me. <laughs> this is just ridiculous. We're going to go down. I don't think we can do that. Right, you. Stop doing that. Go and sort that out. He's just been knocked overboard. Oh, for goodness sake. Right, you. Go back over there. Get the Get the winch. Get the person up. Don't do that. There's a fire. There's literally a fire behind your head. Go and put the fires out, for goodness sake. Put the fires out. Put the fires out. Right, we are taking we're taking an absolute kick in. We're taking a kick in. Uh, yeah, pump water. Pump water. Yeah, I know. We're on it. We're on it. Pump water. Just pump, pump like you've never pumped before. Unbelievable, Jeff. Okay, there's another man overboard. Uh, I don't know if we'll be able to do this. I think we might sink. I think we might actually sink. Uh, no, we need to stop the water. Fill in the cracks. Fill in those cracks. Yeah, just keep doing it. You're quicker at repairing things. You fill in the whole cracks. Yeah, another one. Oh, that's still there. Fill it in, fill it in. Right. You go and fill that in. You go and fill... Oh, you're not even on board the ship yet, are you? You. Go and fill that in. Right. Come on. We can do this. Fill in the cracks. He's still emptying the thing. Their sniper guy is ridiculous. Their sniper guy just keeps knocking my people overboard. Can't do anything. I haven't done anything in ages. We can't get up to the top deck. <laughs> we can't get up. Right, he's frantically pumping water. Okay, Doc, go and do that. You, go and mend this crack. This isn't going to go well. I, the ship's on fire. It's full of water. Can we not just use some of the water that's underneath? Man overboard. Yep, okay, get the winch. You go and put out the fires. Oh, man. Right, fires. There's so many hull breaches. We're going to flood. We're going to flood. We're going to flood. Yeah, we're, we're going down. We're going under. <laughs> oh, we nearly did so well. Bear in mind, we are being absolutely bombarded by things. Right, pump water, it says. I'm trying to pump water as much as I can. I don't... I, I, I think we might need bigger pumps. Deploy bigger pumps. Can we pump the ocean? Can we pump the ocean? Oh, it was a noble effort. Your vessel groans its death knell and collapses under its own weight. It will sail no more. Your career as a captain has reached a grave conclusion. But fear not. Lose your ship in the full game is not the end. You might find yourself stranded or take your chances in a lifeboat. There are perilous situations to be in, but survive long enough to rescue and you can continue on your journey for truth and revenge. Okay, think you can do better. Add abandoned ship to your Steam wish list to find out. There is a link in the description of this video if you want to go and have a look at the Steam page. Oh, that was a shame. But yes, I suppose you do survive. That was hard. That was really hard. In hindsight, if I were to do that again... I would employ an extra person. I would have got an extra person there. Rather than those two extra guns at the front, I would have just got another repair person in. Because that was hard. That was very hard. Being battered by that by the volcanic rock things was bad enough. Then they were firing at me. Then they kept sniping my people overboard, which didn't help. Maybe I should have employed a sniper thing? I don't know. I mean, that was quite a good thing to knock people overboard all the time. That certainly caused me... Well, that's, that's what did it. That's the problem. Because when they snipe you and take a person overboard, that's two people down. Because you've got one person in the sea and one person manning the winch. So you've got two people down already. But this is good. I like this. I like this a lot. So this is only the combat demo. I imagine they will give access to the exploration demo, I would guess it would be called, when that's released before the actual game goes into early access. So we might have a look at that. And then I imagine we shall have a look at this in early access mode as well. So early 2018 on Steam, this is going to come out into early access. So we'll keep our eyes on this. If you have enjoyed this, please do leave a like. And also don't forget to subscribe, particularly if you have enjoyed this, because we shall be playing it. So if you subscribe, you can find out when we're playing it and how we get on. But for now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard, and I will see you next time. Ted, run, 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 Ted, 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 run quicker, Ted. Oh, Ted is green. Oh, dear. Timmy is looking very bad. Okay, there's still the same amount of water. I'm guessing we didn't get robbed. Ah, we got robbed. In no way is this going to break the radio, Ted. And you've broken the radio, Ted.